All right, so it felt like this is a little bit difficult, but it is raining, but I want to capture this. Anyways, we're both back at Barbagello. There was a, there was a pretty hectic uh, drift practice thing going on. Like, yeah, why not? Let's go. You have to pay to enter, of course. Um, but yeah, it, it, it's like slightly raining. All the, the ground is all wet. It is, it is perfect just to just go crazy. And there's people just sending it everywhere. Like, look at this. On the actual race track, they're sending it. I believe that's... Uh, that's what we're doing anyways and there's just people going going and just lapping and doing all this stuff like look uh oh somebody had an accident Ooh, oh oh I caught that flame but someone had an accident way down there Has to be pretty crazy. Motorplex is, it's, you experience a lot of stuff. And, and it literally makes you want to bring your own car here. But I have a car that's not even worthy to bring here at all. Oh my God, that thing is shooting flames. Are you seeing it? And look, and then there's people that are like, ripping it crazy ways. Just doing like donuts and stuff. That's all he's doing. On the, on the actual track itself. So we came to this event, um, it's a little bit rainy but the rain has stopped and it's a pretty amazing night to be honest. Something to come to if you're bored, uh, it is $10 per person. I have that which they have set up, down over there another set up zone. My whole shoe just got drenched. Oh nice. And then they have the actual racetrack. The racetrack which is for all those hot cars racing on the last time we were here. That has now become a whole drift pad. See, you know what this is actually the best for? You know what this is the best for? What? This is something that you would do. A rear wheel drive car. Go on this skid pad, rainy like this, and you just bang loud music. That is something that you would 110% do. I'd just kick back to some music. They're just sending us sideways on the track. It is hectic, man. Yeah, we'll go to that end down there so we can get a, a better view. That's how you. That's how you raise a boner and make it just shoot out jizz. Well, I think that's a bit too much for you too. <laughs> After those sounds, I don't care. Hey, look, look. What? What? It's not like it's it's a it's what people do when they put um, LS swap a jab car. They put that in the in the hood. <laughs> Han didn't LS swap his RX-7. Yeah, if you like Han, he, uh, Han didn't uh, fucking LS swap his RX-7, so you don't have to do it. You don't do it. Yeah. Oh. Then, what? 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 It's just like a night to just send it. And it's such a perfect night, it's a Saturday night. Saturday night, send it night. Undoubtedly, when I get my car, I'm coming here. This is gonna be my new home. Yeah, we, we look far with our tourists. <laughs> yeah, both the organic cameras. <laughs> oh shit. Yo! This is gonna be some hectic shit. Waiting for him to rip it. Three, two, one.
slow your engine if you want, I think. But I don't know if they'll like that. Just, just go for it. But we will drive preferably so you can actually have fun. Not that you can't have fun in other cars, but hey. Just listen to that. What? The vehicle behind you having a dose is... Oh. This is why you gotta own a real drive car. At Barbagello Raceway. This is where the event's taking place. Starts at 5pm. Drifting starts at 6. It's on till... It's on till 10. And it's just people sending him. That's literally all it is. And you can literally come here, sit back, food, and just enjoy. I gotta give this guy props. This guy? Yeah, this guy... Yeah, this guy's not doing it. He's been treading it non-stop. Yeah, that's the thing. I give props to this guy. Oh, shit! Oh, we get it. <laughs> that's... Oh, yeah. Yeah, throwing tantrums today. Like, in here to do it? Um, but, or like, just signing in pretty yeah, much. Yeah, yeah. Just going to the office, really. Yeah, is there a fee? Uh, yeah, well, today my mate just signed in, like, pretty much for your one year membership yeah. and your CAMS license. It was 410 bucks. Oh, that's alright. Right. Yeah, so that's yeah. membership and pretty much going in for that one night. Yeah. And after that, it's 75 bucks per night. So there's different types of memberships? Yeah, so you got the um, Your Car, Our Track, which is pretty much more for grassroots people who are new, um, which is mostly catered for if you want to do infield training and doing main track training. Yeah. But if you, if you get the full membership, you get uh, cheaper prices on like, the racing events, like rounds, like series. Um, but it's an additional 150 bucks or something. That's so right. like if you're so if you're new, I'd, I'd mostly recommend the your car our track, which is I think 100. And 145 bucks. Right. That's not bad. Yeah. And then on top of that, you pay for your um, startup fee of I think fifty dollars. And then on top of that, pay for your cams license. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that's awesome. Thanks a lot, man. Thanks yeah, for no, letting us know. Yeah. Well, good Thank luck. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Look what we have here. Yes, it is a Subaru drifting. Carson, do explain. Tell them the story. It's a bug eye Subaru with a rear wheel drive conversion, and they're drifting this. Interesting to see it actually done in real life and not in Forza by some child who throws on a shit ton of livery and then doesn't know what they're doing, turn up all the settings and say hey. I'm a drift king. <laughs> Woo! Props to this guy, man. Props to him. See that? You just get in your car, drift, come back, get out and then yell at your mate, be like, hey, what's up, dog? Oh, they got a food store here, man. If you get hungry, me drift. Take a, I mean, get hungry mid drift. Take a snack mid drift. Do it. Initial D style. Oh shit. But oh, damn. That dude, that was the dude. That dude right there took some serious angle in his drifts, man. I was watching him. There's another car behind us, so watch out. Let's see this one. They're proper drift spec. That's so sick. Yep, this is why we're on this spot. Dude, dude, there's a kid next to me and he's crying. Dude, what do I do? He's crying. <laughs> other, than that, other than that, this is why I came here. Same. Oh, Player one has entered. 
in the match. We, I just got to look inside of a drift car and let me tell you, that was very nice. Very nice. You sure know how to make a person nut now, don't you? <laughs> that interior, those, those seats, full drift spec. I've probably mentioned drift spec a hundred times, but... Got to come down here and experience it. It's something so different. It's just a different feeling. It's like, it's like an escape, I guess you could say. Well, cars are an escape, but this is the level of actually escaping. When you're out there on the track, you've escaped. Just there on that grass right there moments ago. But now we're here. Up close. If you could, if you don't call that an escape, you see the gate? I, I saw the gate. Now that is an escape. Holy shit! That, that was awesome. Right Just listen to it. Fellas, take a look at this. That's 14.5. That's 15 front. That's 14 rear. Look at that. Like, zi literally zip tie the bumpers on. Not just staying there now. That's so cool. <laughs> Carbon fiber hood. You can see that. The interior is completely stripped. Buttons, dials is there. Helmet, hydro brake, shifter. No speedo, no nothing, no no RPM gauge at all. Or just the steering wheel. Oh, oh, someone spun out. But he's got it. It's just after 8.20. Same people sending a ham for hours and hours getting practice on. If you like drifting, you like racing, you like motorsports, this is a really, really good experience and it'll motivate you to do more. 100%. The super, 100%. At, work, yeah. the super at work? Yeah. You're looking at me like I've seen a super at work. You know how I took the video and I was like, is that a super? Yeah. Yeah, it was at work. Shit. The girl who owns it works in the center too. Oh, what made her bring a super out? Red P plate up. Yeah. Damn, that's turbo, yeah? You checked if it's manual? Yeah. No, I didn't check, no, I didn't check. Okay. But the way she was driving it, sound like it was the first. She didn't change all the way around the roundabout. But how you go, you go down first, you go to the speed bump. Yeah. And she just idles around and then she takes off. Let's see. That's an 
the S15. Yeah. <laughs> Some cars going on the track. And these ones haven't gone on the track before from what I know. What? Those ones? Those ones, yeah. Really? I don't remember seeing an S15 go sideways. Yeah, no, he was the one that went in 70 degrees. You weren't even looking, you are on your no, phone. No, because remember you told me to turn back around, and every time I turned around he had just finished doing it, but I know the car. Okay. Okay, well it was far away, it was from a distance, I was just saying. Camera. Oh, you done? <laughs> <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, it's awesome. Perth Motorplex. Thank God, Perth Motorplex is Perth Motorplex and it's here in Perth. Hey, you got a buddy here. You got a buddy here. Oh, he. And then... Oh, so that's who has the SR20 plate in Perth. Perth, all of WA. Woohoo! Oi, dog! Oi! Oi! Don't copyright me, you dog! Oops. <laughs> this guy. Uh, I put my Crocs in race mode. Um. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Just, just go, just go visit Motorplex. You gotta tell them to go to Motorplex. Do I? Yes, because it's an awesome experience. You didn't pay me for that. Excuse me, I paid for fucking entry. <laughs> you owe me 10 bucks. <laughs> I know. But, like I said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoy, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And I'll see you guys in the next one. So you find your way back home.